everybody this is Connie I am back with you um, with a makeup of the day I am pre-recording um, just because I felt like it I just felt like recording today so I do have several videos that I'm gonna do today so you will see the same top um, somebody told me in my last video that they loved my purple so I decided to wear my favorite purple shirt and it's just a t-shirt, but it is stretchy, which I, I absolutely love it. It just, I like the way it fits me. Um, so, and I was going to wear a different lipstick, but I decided I'd wear kind of a purplish lipstick because of my top. Um, and I was going to wear that top from um, Kmart that I got. And I decided I'm going to take it back because um, it just is too big up here. Either either my bra is showing here or it's showing up here. My bra straps are showing up here. It's just too loose around the neck. I, I just am not comfortable wearing it. So if I'm not comfortable wearing it, what's the use? So I'm just going to take it back. I can't find the stupid receipt now. So if it's been on sale since then, I'll get it for the sale price. But that's okay. I'm going to take it back. Um, just funny in my pocket, right? <laughs> okay, so for my makeup of the day, I've got a couple things to, to talk to you about. I'm going to do a first impressions today, too. So, um, okay, the first thing I did was I just got this in one of my boxes, and it is the Emity Makeup, oops, Emity Makeup uh, Diamond Heart Base Primer, and it's illuminating. Um, this here is not bad. It's it's tinted, you know. It's got a tint to it, and it's really not too bad. Um, it's not like the other ones, though, where just a tiny bit will do you. I mean, you have to use more of this to get good coverage on your face. Okay, so my first impression today was of the um, new Dream Velvet Soft Matte Hydrating Foundation. Uh, by Maybelline. I had hauled this oh a couple of weeks ago or at right after Christmas or something I don't even remember but um, I got it in the color 15 ivory and and I think that is just a touch too dark for me. I need a light ivory. If I'm gonna go with ivory I need a light ivory. Um, just regular ivory is just a little bit too dark for me but I but it worked. Um, I got it to work so you know I don't I can still see a touch of it on my neck, even though I blended it down. So you know it's too dark. Anyway, it's um, very thick. Comes out of the tube very thick. It's like a moussey consistency, only a, it's thicker mousse. Um, you don't need a whole lot. Um, and it covers beautifully. It blends beautifully. Um, I'm very impressed with that. We will see how it goes, um, you know, the rest of the day. I will, it is not, it is probably about 2 o'clock in the afternoon maybe. And we'll see how it goes. But um, first impressions, not bad. I just need a different color. And I don't think that they will take this back. Do they take, please tell me, do they take stuff like this back at the drugstore? Or exchange it? at the drugstore? Let me know. Okay, so that is that. Then I went in with my eyebrows and do you know that I still cannot find my spoolie? And I looked everywhere. I can't find one on the on well, Elf has got one for three dollars on their their website. I could order that. Um, I just don't want to spend the money right now. Uh, I looked on on uh, Amazon, I couldn't find anything cheaper than the Elf at three dollars. But I looked in every store in town, and do you think anybody would hold it? They they've all got the um, the the comb and the brush, but I don't like them. I want the spoolie so I can brush through my eyebrows after I do the gel. Um, I used an, one of my new ones um, from Essence Make Me Brow Eyebrow Gel Mascara, and it is in Zero Two Brownie Brows, 
and I think it was it it does not cover well at all. It's got the little little spoolie like I like. I really like that size spoolie, but it just there was no coverage, and what there was I thought was very light coverage. So I went in with the powder. I don't like using the powders anymore. I used to use them before I figured out the brow mascara, but um, I think I made a bigger mess of them. <laughs> I am not good at my brows at all, and I just need to find a holy grail brow mascara. Okay, I went in with, this is what I went in with, is my, my old standby uh, eyebrow palette, the uh, American Icon by Clean Color. And I use this one. All right, that's my brows. So then for eyeshadow, I used my Kat Von D uh, Fever Ray palette. I used this all over the brow. Then I used this on the in the crease and a little bit on my eye eyelid. And then um, this here I used on my bottom brow, or bottom eyelid, just for kind of like a liner. I didn't use an eyeliner, to, a, a regular eyeliner today. Then I went in, you know me, I went in and I put um, some of this, let's see here, it is, it's in the nude shimmer strips, uh, Physician's Formula, and it's cream eyeshadow stuff. They come in a trio. I got all three of them, um, but I just put that on my lids for that pop that I love. Okay, those are my eyes. Um, then I went in and I did put a little bit of, of this in the bottom lashes, or bottom waterline. And this is uh, Beauty For Real, and I used this. It's kind of a brownish red. Okay, use that in the bottom waterline. Then I went in with my Smashbox Full Exposure Mascara. This is just deluxe sample size, but I absolutely, I love this mascara. I love this mascara. I think it's awesome. I, I will definitely, if, you know, if I can ever afford it, get a full size. <laughs> okay, so then concealer. This is the Laura Geller um, Creaseless Concealer, Line Smoothing Pen. Now, I like this once once you get it on and once you get it blended in. I do like it, but it takes forever. I hate these kind that you have to click, click, click to get the product up, up into the brush. I'm not happy with this at all. Um, I would not repurchase this because of that, because it takes forever. Click, 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 click. And then you got to click, 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 click more. Then you got to click, click, click more. So I, I'm not happy with this. It and it's in the color light. Um, I just don't like it at all. Even though the concealer part is awesome, if it just came in a stick or in something, I would like it so much better. But not, not in this form anymore. All right. So um, for blush, I decided I'd use my new. Hikari, I just got it in a, in a beauty box. And this is in Tango, the color Tango. And I tell you what, I tap my brush once, put it on, and and you can tell. Um, I kind of blended it out a little bit, but it is really bright. You have to be careful with this stuff. Then I used um, my e.l.f. concealer. This is, uh, not concealer, baked highlighter. And this is in... Moonlight Pearls. It's so pretty. It is such a pretty. So pretty. I really like it. Okay, so then I went in um, and did my whole face with this powder. And it's by Pure. And it's a 4-in-1 Pressed Mineral Makeup SPF 15 something. Anyway, this is the powder. I just went in and, and uh, all over my face. And then for lipstick, I used the Ulta 
I can't put my glasses on for this one. This is driving me nuts. Cannot figure out why this thing will not work. I'm going to have to see if maybe I can go get some new batteries or something for this thing. Ooh. It'll work for two seconds. Mystery is what this is called. It's um, Ulta. And it just comes in, a, it's just a little, little lipstick. But it's, it's really, it's full size pretty much. Um, but this is what it looks like. It's, uh, it's got kind of a fruity smell or something. Um, it's not strong. I don't smell it at all unless I've got it right up to my nose. So anyway, that is my makeup of the day. Okay, so the next thing I want to talk to you guys about. Um, I had a, a subscriber ask me this morning, and I'm really sorry. I don't remember. Um, she's on Instagram. She left me a note on Instagram. I am so sorry. Um, I will link her down below. But she asked me if I would do a question and answer video um, for my all my new subscribers. And I would be happy to. So just leave me a question down below and I will um, write it down. And next week sometime I will do, let's, let's give it a week. Um, or whatever, I don't know. Let's try to get as many questions as we can, and we'll try to do at least 25 questions. How's that sound? So um, ask me anything you want. Uh, don't be mean. <laughs> but, um, you know, just ask me anything you want. Ask me. I'll be honest and truthful with you like I always am. So that is one thing about me. I am not fake. <laughs> um, I don't. You know, if I was fake, I'd be smiling and happy and bubbly and, and, you know, but that's really not me. That's not my my illness. That's not, you know, all that stuff. So anyway, um, ask me anything you want. And if you like this kind of video, give me a thumbs up. Also, let me know if you tried this, what your, what your opinions were on it. Um, I do like it, although I just have it in the wrong color. And, and tell me, can... Can I take this back and exchange it? 